Now let us try to isolate variables where cubes are involved. So the question here is solve each equation for the indicated variable. The first equation is volume V is equals to S cube. Well you have volume as cube of the sides for a cube where S is length of each side. The reverse of cube is cube root. So we can isolate S by finding cube root on both the sides. In a way, what we're trying to do is we are saying what is the cube root of volume and what is the cube root of S cube. So if you do cube root on both sides, you get cube root of volume as equal to the side. So that is how we can isolate side of a cube in this case as cube root of the volume, right? So side is cube root of volume. So if we have a cube with a volume of 1000 cubic centimeter, then each side will be cube root of 1000, that is 10 centimeters, correct? So that is how you can apply the formula and solve a question. Now let's look into another example where we have cube of radius. Here volume V is equal to 4 over 3 pi r cube and we need to isolate for r. Well this is an example of a sphere where r is the radius, v is the volume. To isolate for r cube, let us first get rid of 4 over 3 pi. So we'll do reverse operation. So reverse operation here should be to the volume. What we will do? We'll multiply by 3, divide by 4, and divide by pi. So basically both sides we are going to multiply by 3 and divide by 4 pi. So let me rewrite the equation with this reverse operation. So the reverse operation which we are doing here is times 3 and divide by 4 pi. Now as you can see from here on the right side 4 divided by 4 is 1, pi divided by pi is 1, 3 divided by 3 is also 1. So what we are left with is r cube equals to 3 over 4 pi, I mean pi, this is pi, volume. Is it okay? So from here we can do cube root both sides just as we did here. So we'll get r on the right side and we'll get cube root of 3 times volume divided by 4 times pi. So that is how we can isolate for the radius r of the sphere. I hope the steps are clear. So go through them once again and notice that we have to do reverse operation while isolating for the variables. Thank you and all the best.